Mary, where's Nancy? We're getting late. Wait a minute, I'll call her. Nancy! Hi. We're getting late, come fast. I'm sorry. Mom, Dad, I'm so excited. As a festival Easter is just around the corner. Yes, dear, it's not an ordinary festival. Dad, why do we celebrate Easter? I'll tell you everything about Easter, but let's get going first. Palm Sunday commemorates Christ's triumphant arrival in Jerusalem to the cheers of the crowd. The people took palm leaves and went out to meet him. They sang, Hosanna, Hosanna. Blessed is who comes in the name of the Lord. Blessed is the King of Israel. It was a wonderful entry, wasn't it, Dad? Yes, it was. The next is Monday Thursday. Jesus Christ had many enemies who wanted to get rid of him. Christians remember Monday Thursday as the day of the Last Supper when Jesus washed the feet of his twelve disciples and showed the symbol of humility and obedience. But above all, the most important events in Christianity are the love and later the suffering of Jesus Christ. Good Friday commemorates the passion, the execution of Jesus by crucifixion. Mom, I cannot believe it. But above all, the most important events in Christianity are the death and later the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Good Friday commemorates the passion, the execution of Jesus by crucifixion. During this day, Christians meditate on Jesus' suffering and death on the cross at 3 p.m. on Mount Calvary. Mom, I cannot believe it. Crucifixion? He must have gone through a lot. Yes, dear. He has suffered a lot. Later, his body was taken down from the cross and buried in a tomb, which was sealed by an enormous stone and guarded by soldiers, so that no one could steal his body. Easter commemorates the resurrection of Jesus Christ roughly on 30 AD. It's the most important Christian festival and the one celebrated with the most joy. On Easter Sunday, some women visited the grave and found it empty. There was a violent earthquake and an angel appeared before them and said, Don't be afraid, peace be with you. Jesus has risen from the dead. They were all so excited and informed the disciples about Jesus' resurrection. They believed that God has raised Jesus from the dead. Later, Jesus Christ visited his disciples and sent them to every part of the world to proclaim the good news to the whole creation. Do you know, dear? Jesus died as a ransom sacrifice for our sins and he resurrected to give us hope over despair, victory over defeat, peace over evil and love over hatred. This is what Easter is. Did you understand? On this day, churches are filled with flowers. There are special hymns, songs are sung and prayer services are held. Easter eggs and cakes are distributed among all of us. Everyone hugs each other and wishes Happy Easter to celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ. At present, we are facing difficult times. This pandemic is a tremendous challenge for the church, for all the people worldwide and for our common home. Still, the crisis is an opportunity to start anew. Yes, life will prevail over death once again. So dear, today's Easter message is that the risen Christ makes all things anew and He sustains us in our vulnerability, guides us through darkness and reconciles us with the source of life. May this simple message help us to the light and life of Christ in these times of darkness and death. May the resurrected Jesus bless each one of us and our families. Let's celebrate a blessed Easter. So dear, on this Easter day, let's spread the message of love and peace among us. Yes, Mom and Dad, now understand why Easter is the greatest festival of Christians. We wish you a happy Easter.
Thank <laughs> you.